This is how you can create a low poly tree in any 3D application in just under three minutes. I'm going to be using 3D Studio Max, and I'm really sorry for saying three so many times in this video already. Before we get started, I'd like to tell you that there are different names within 3D applications. So for example, 3D Studio Max might have a name for a specific tool, and Blender might have a different name for the exact same tool. So keep that in mind. And let's get started. What you want to do is to go up to the Create tab, select Geosphere, and select Tetra in the base type, and use three segments. What you then want to do is to scale the model up a bit and convert it into an editable poly, select Elements, and go down to Smoothing Groups, and clear the smoothing groups. You then want to go to Freeform, Paint Deformation, and Shift, and shift the model around to make the geometry look a bit more uneven. I'm then going to make two copies, scale them and rotate them to make them look a bit more uneven. I'm then going to make a cylinder with the height segment of three and five sides. And I'm going to convert this into an editable poly. Select elements and clear the smoothing groups. And now shifting around the vertices to make the tree look a bit more uneven. I'm going to be scaling the top down and scaling the bottom to make it look more like a tree. I'm then going to make a copy of the tree. Remove the bottom half and cap the bottom. And this will become the branches of the tree. I'm now going to be scaling this around and changing the vertices around to make them a bit smaller than the actual tree. I'm now going to go into the pivot mode and change the object's pivot to the bottom of the object. I'm then going to rotate this around and place it onto the tree. I'm going to make a copy and place another one here. I'm trying to make them look a bit uneven. Now I'm trying to arrange and place the leaves or the geospheres onto the tree. Just trying to shift the vertices around a bit more. I will now press M on the keyboard to open the material editor and then drag out two standard materials. The first one here is going to be for the leaves of the tree or the geospheres. Just going to be dragging this out onto the geospheres. And I'm going to make another one, a brown color, for the root of the tree. There we go, that's the tree in three minutes. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give this a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Have a good day, and I'll see you soon.